All right, so this is future me coming to talk to you. Listen, this was the morning that I left my apartment to come into the airport in Kingston to start my journey, start my adventure. You can just call me Captain Captain Adventure at this point. Anyway, guys, I had this whole thing in my head, you know, I was going to do this whole exciting, you know, um, video outside of the airport with my friend who dropped me off. But anyway, never get to do that because I'm shy as backside. This is the lounge, the Norman Manley um, Club Club Kingston Lounge at Norman Manley International Airport. This is where I come and hang out and just, you know, get coffee, etc. I just hang out. I come here to do work. To be honest with you because i don't really eat the stuff here they don't have any gluten-free options very few gluten-free options i come here to just sit down comfortably to do some work this is me as a vlogger girl because girl is vlogger per guys i sit on my camera and everything and i was like look at me let me let me take up the coffee cup let me take up the coffee cup just in case you know it i don't want it to look too proppy but it turned out looking so proppy and this is me giving you an outfit check you know i have to show you that i can still dance so this is my little dance it down i'm in the lounge still i'm waiting for my flight i'm boarding in about an hour i'm like three hours early because i have anxiety and it wouldn't make sense for me to just wait at home because i've just been thinking about this you know so i just said let me just come here come to the lounge and do some work have I done any work? I have not done any work, but just here hanging out. Now listen, this is what you call the certified hot girl hopscotch. You know, the dainty version of the hopscotch because you're not going to be jumping and sweating all over the place. Anyway, while you watch this, let me just explain to you that my guts were in knots. My gut was in knots or however the saying go because now it's kicking in like, girl, what the hell are you doing? But it's not too late to turn back because you have like 500 million flights that you've already booked. 500 million places that you've already booked to sleep yes yes anyway this is me on the flight to miami where i met a man who sat right next to me i sat in business and we discussed business yay it's okay so i landed in this is miami and this is awkward as hell recording in public but i'm doing it for you guys anyway i'm at the miami airport i'm gonna flip it to show you guys what it's looking like This is what it looks like for those who haven't been here for a while or have never been here. This is what it looks like. And when you come out, so you come out of TSA. No, it's not TSA. It's TSA? I don't know where that's called, but they're going to check your passport again um, and your ticket again. And then you come out here in the terminal if you're flying American Airlines. I'm going to the lounge now, which we're going to just take this. So that's the lounge I'm going to. So we're going to take the elevator. Sorry, the escalator up to the lounge this is what it looks like I'm gonna go up again up again up again I'm on the train I don't know if I'm going the right way to be honest with you but we're gonna see we have some time It was the right train it was the right way anyway guys at this point i'm so nervous it's i'm getting more and more nervous now i'm realizing that i'm a like certified mad girl but this is what life is for you know you only get one life you get to do crazy things okay so we came on the escalator and then we're gonna go into the lounge now this is what it looks like i'll show you more inside I couldn't wait for the do voiceover here about how the lounge stay. One of the worst lounges I've been to. The food, bit, the food options are so limited. The food that I did end up eating it was so dry, so flavorless. It was just not what I was looking for at all. I've been to this lounge before and it wasn't this bad. Well, I don't recall it being this bad, but 
this is not a lounge I would go to again. But I mean, if I don't have a choice, I would. Look at look at my plate. Look at my plate. They have the audacity to call this Caribbean chicken. What part of the Caribbean eat this kind of chicken, guys? Please let me know in the comment section. So, you know, I had to grab a banana and an apple to take with me as portable food, just in case. This is the bathroom. Lounge bathrooms don't usually look like this. They usually look better. I mean, overseas, that is. They tend to look better, way better, a lot more fancy. I don't know how I don't remember this bathroom looking like this but this is the bathroom anyway we're on our flight now we forget which part of flight i go but it i go somewhere oh it was going to charlotte so we're on this flight i got coffee and stuff and i was showing you guys my fancy my fancy treats they gave to me this brownie brittle thing that i remember tasting so good and this energy bite thing was also very good loved it for me now this is me at i stopped at the lounge in charlotte again and it was the same thing as in miami the exact food the exact drinks the exact layout everything was the same so i didn't think to just show you guys the same thing but this is the airport in charlotte guys yay we've landed guess what oh my goodness the pilot was so hot or so i thought this guy came in and his uniform was like oh my goodness this plane is definitely gonna land so fine and it's gonna be so great we're gonna be so safe because this pilot is so hot news flash it wasn't the pilot it was probably like a junior i don't know he wasn't the, the og pilot if you know what i mean so much has happened since on that flight i have so much to tell you guys i wrote notes so i wouldn't forget anything but i got you <laughs> So I'm about to miss my flight, but I needed you guys to see how cute this is in the airport. Isn't this so cute? I'm about to miss my flight though. <laughs> Okay, so I didn't miss my flight, but let me tell you, in that clip where I told you that I have so much to tell you, it was just that the pilot was hot, or, or I, I thought he was a pilot, but the flight attendant, she was really beautiful, and oh my goodness, there was a bag that was left in the jet bridge, and the pilot came on asking, whose bag is this? And I was like, yo, you don't watch movie? Why are we still on this plane right now? You don't watch movie? There's like this one lonesome bag on the jet bridge. That screams B-O-M-B, -B, yo. We need to be, take off right now, fam, take off right now, or let us off of this thing because i'm not about to boom but it wasn't that it was somebody um on the plane who forgot their bag who who forgets their bag on the jet bridge who forgets their bag so anyway moving right along i got my fancy chips again fancy treats again and we're off i saw this um I don't remember where this was to be honest oh i remember this was over washington dc i looked down trying to find the um white house and thing but obviously i was so far away from the white house and thing the airport that i was going to was um on the outskirts of washington dc it's a small small airport do you see the feel <laughs> it's like literally in the middle of i don't want to say the middle of nowhere but kind of in the middle of nowhere you know what i mean i don't know how i ended up at this airport actually i do know i was trying to save money because you know your girl is cheap as backside so this is me in some like no name airport because i'm trying to be cheap yeah this is the airport now so i come off the plane and stuff and now i need to go retrieve my bag let me tell you all me i pray to god me on my knees me say god please don't make them lost my bag please 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 i'm afraid for check my app for see if them lost the bag because i'm now on anxiety so this is so nice my hotel has free shuttle right outside like i came out right there and it's just here so nice so anyway this is 7 30 p.m 7 30 p.m still light out so i'm gonna go home i'm gonna go to the hotel i should say i'll show you guys when i'm there this is nice this is a nice bus it's so cozy i'm the only one in here it's dark cold just the way i love it the driver took my bags loaded them up for me which i really appreciate Oddly enough, I'm not tired. I don't know if it's because it's light out, but I'm not tired at all. <laughs> okay, guys. This is the end of travel day. I store creepy people check. Let's see if... Okay, nobody's there. <laughs> nobody's there. 
Nobody can be under the bed. All right, we're all set. <laughs> Okay guys, so this is the end of travel day one. It was quite, I mean, I wanna say it was a long day, but to be honest with you, even though I went through like three different airports, it didn't feel that long. I think it's because my flights were like so close to each other, but it didn't feel that long. Um, I went to the lounges, probably that's why it also didn't feel too long, but I'm here now. This is, this hotel is an airport hotel and I'm actually shocked by the quality of it because it's an airport hotel. If you know anything about airport hotels, you know that they're not like the best. But this is, it seems clean so far. I actually booked here because one of my friends who is a manager at um, Marriott, the Marriott group, he told me about their cleaning standards and stuff. So I was like, all right, I can do this. <laughs> my OCD was going crazy. Uh, which is why I didn't book anything. I booked this last minute because I couldn't find anywhere close to the airport to stay. So um, I booked this last minute after talking to my friend and I was like, all right, I feel comfortable enough. But anyway, we're just going to be here. And by we, I mean me and you, so don't get no ideas. <laughs> we're just going to be in this hotel room for two days. And then I have my flight to South Africa thereafter. That's when I'm going to give you travel day number two guys thank you so much for watching i don't know what exactly you're gonna see yet because i took like a bunch of footage because i'm trying i hope you guys notice that i'm trying okay i'm trying to be a vlogger for you guys so i'm gonna go get some food now um that's all folks don't forget to you know the drill like subscribe comment and share bye